You ready? What are we leading with? What do we always leave with? I don't know what. Whatever you want to start with. Okay. Praise the Lord and pass the ammunition. Welcome to the TIB All-Star Show. I am Mark the Whole Damn Show Garbett. To my right, immediate right, is Tom Bloomer, the business end of the blogosphere, found at busyblog.com, busyblog.com. And of course, to my farther left, my far left, or my far left, really far left, my far right, so far left, I'm now on the right. Yes. 4,000 miles to the left. <laughs> yes, is uh, Matt Hurley. Matt and I do a little blog called Weapons of Mass Discussion, found at Mass Discussion. Dot blogspot.com, mass discussion, dot blogspot. Yes. Dot com. Which, which during the current week or maybe two weeks ought to maybe consider a renaming as mass disruption dot blogspot.com, <laughs> given uh, some of what's been accomplished by its uh, proprietors. Or you could call it mass taking out the trash dot com. Yeah, there you go. Uh, because uh, here in the heartland in uh, southwestern Ohio, we had a scumbag, corrupt, blowhard auditor, county auditor by the name of Kay Rogers, who was trying to smear uh, other people for her own misdeeds. Now, of course, you might think because she's projecting her misdeeds onto someone else that she would be a liberal Democrat. No. But no. She actually is a Republican. And the funny thing is, that four years ago, Matt and I were questioning why didn't the county party endorse this woman for the office when she seemed to be so popular? Maybe now, in hindsight, maybe there were they knew something that we didn't. Yeah, well, they did. Why didn't they say anything? Well, some of that has to do, I think, with a federal investigation. Some of it has to yeah, do with it, things it, like that. As we reveal some of the details of the story, I think you're going to find that our good friends in the Butler County GOP didn't necessarily have access to all the information as part of it, but the other part of it is uh, the people who did have access to the information were probably under the, it was probably in the best interest of the investigation not to reveal I anything. It's an ongoing sure. investigation. That's understandable. Usually uh, that is that is the uh, modus operandi. So, so the GOP knew enough not to endorse her. I would say so. Yeah. So 